Hey guys, Lethal Leslie here, and today we're hunting the first of the legendary animals that we've hunted on this channel, and we're going to be going for the legendary wolf. So I'm just getting gearing up here, camping and all that, getting ready. Let's sleep until morning so we can get into this, guys. Um, and I'm going to show you exactly where we are just in a second now, so you know exactly where to find the legendary wolf, so you can go and hunt it yourself, guys. One thing to note when you're hunting legendary animals, very important in my opinion, is that quality does not matter when of the kill. It's just that you get the kill. So you need to like you don't need to worry about getting that quality kill on these particular animals because you can only hunt them once and they're not that stingy that you need to hunt them in uh, mint condition. But obviously we're going to try our best to get as good a kill as we possibly can because that's fun as well. So let me just zoom out here so you can see exactly where we are, guys. We're right at the top of the map. And if you're looking between the letters A and R in Amberino, probably the best way to locate it. And you'll see just like a little circle here. And then there's the word Kotora Spring. And it's literally right. Kotora Spring is where it's at. When you get there, you'll draw the picture of the, uh, the wolf. That's not there beforehand kind of thing. That becomes after. And so that is where the, it's located. Hopefully that's good enough for you. Any questions on location, uh, leave them in the comment section down below. And of course, I'll answer them, guys. And let's get into it. So we'll leave our horse and our campfire here. Let's have a look for the first clue, see if we can find a clue on this. These are some wolves I killed earlier when I came up here. They tried to kill me. Ah, there we go. We found our first clue for the wolf. So let's head over to that first clue. Like I said, this is the first legendary animal I've hunted myself. So I'm not even sure how, how it's going to go or how tough it's going to be, guys. So I'm learning on the job myself here. Let's inspect this first clue. Wolf done. Good head start. See, we've got our first clue here, so we're going to go ahead and like have a in, inspect this clue now. And the way you get this up is obviously, if you don't know, you should already know this if you've got to this point in the game, because it does show you as you press both the analog buttons in, and you'll find that first clue. It'll give you the option to see this, and when you see this, you know you're in the right area. And there's a bit of fur here, so let's expect, inspect it and see what he says. Okay, he's over here somewhere. You gotta be quite fast inspecting the animals. Ah, I see, we see the next clue there. So you, what it is, is after you instantly search, you can see you only get a certain amount of time to move towards the next clue before it disappears. So we've managed to get to the next one in time here. And like then you had to find another clue if you don't manage to find this one kind of thing. So we have found the next one here. It looks like something maybe he's eaten. So let's go ahead and inspect this, see what it says. It's a carcass, yeah. All right, next direction. Where are we going, guys? Ah, okay, so there we go. It's over here. Let's see, we're moving in the right direction here. You can see the flashing. Oh, wow. I think it's coming towards us. We are screwed. Right between the eyes, come on. Wow, this is mad. Wow, down it goes, guys. Bloody Nora, that was quite scary. I apparently I was expecting another clue before we found him, but we found anyway, we found him. And with these wolves now, like I said, you only get one of these. So, like, you want to make sure you do not leave it behind after you've hunted it. You have to take it with you. That was not exactly the elegant hunt in any way, shape, or form that I was expecting. And I'm not going to lie. I ended up having to just revolve it into the head using my dead eye. Um, but we've got, look how big he is, guys. He's absolutely huge. He's so cool. And maybe we should go and have a look now, see if I can see him in the... Oh, that's another thing. As you can see on the map here, now they get, it gets crossed out once you've hunted him. So, for instance, I... I hunted the bear right at the start of the game. The bear's over here, crossed out kind of thing. But when before you've hunted them, they won't be crossed out. So we have done our wolf now. 
Um, like I said, not quite the elegant hint I was hoping for, guys, but I will take it. We've got him. I actually thought expecting to kill us there. He didn't. We got those headshots in using our dead eye. So you want to make sure you have a dead eye baffle. You can see we used every single bit of dead eye we had there to get this guy sorted, and we're going to put him on our horse, hundred percent. Not sure whether I want to skin him yet because I want to. I want to, you know, keep the meat. So I'm going to take him into town now and um, skin, skin him and stuff like that. I'll take him into camp even and skin him um, there. But another thing is quite important as well is you. I don't really know where to keep him to keep him safe because it is a big skin. Um, you know, maybe you can tell me that, guys. But that is the wolf hunt anyway for you there. The legendary wolf location and hunt. And maybe the next one I do will be a little bit more classy, guys, instead of just revolver into the head. But anyway, we got the wolf. I'm happy. If you like the video, like the video, subscribe if you want to see more. Thanks for watching, as always, and take it easy.